In this video, I want to compare and contrast the Zwilling Pro to the Shun Premier. Both are the very high-end knife lines by these two companies, so it makes sense to do this. The knives are actually pretty similar, but also pretty different. They're both handmade, they're both forged, and they're both actually ground to very similar cutting angles. The Premier is a very sharp 16 degrees, and the Zwilling is a little bit sharper at 15 degrees, but in terms of practical use, they're going to act very similar in terms of cutting. The big differences come, obviously, in how the knives are made. The Zwilling is made with a single piece of metal. It's about 57 hardness, and it's their own proprietary blend. While the Shun uses a wrapped core, and the core is actually VG Max, which is a notch higher than even the VG10 gold standard, it's about 61 hardness. And what that means is these two knives are going to be very different in how they wear. You're going to need to sharpen and hone the Zwilling much more often than you will the Shun. On top of that, either side of the Shun is wrapped in 34 layers of stainless steel, which gives you that gorgeous Damascus design at the bottom, and the top half is hammered as well. Both knives have full tangs. Obviously, the handle of the Zwilling is a very traditional German design, while the handle of the Shun is a much more traditional Japanese handle. They are very, very ergonomic, I would say, both of them. The materials are different as well. The Zwilling uses two black plastic scales, while the Shun uses a pack of wood, a brown pack of wood to be specific, which is a compressed resin-filled wood. They're both going to be very, very resistant to water damage and staining and things like that. Both have lifetime warranties, but the Shun also comes with lifetime sharpening for free, which I think is a deal breaker, especially if you don't want to have to spend $5 an inch to sharpen your knife outside, and if you don't want to have to do it yourself at home. I'll put a link down to both below. If you have any questions, any comments, or any concerns, as always, let me know. And otherwise, I will talk to you very, very soon.